according to an article published on July 10, 2023, by Top War, another shipment of the new lightweight all-terrain tactical vehicles, Arafe, is being sent to the fighters of one of the BARS units engaged in combat operations in the southern direction within the Zaporizhia region, Ukraine. The vehicles were loaded onto an Illinois 76MD military transport aircraft of the Russian Aerospace Forces, VKSRF, at the International Airport, Khabarovsk Novi. The buggies were transported to the Illinois 76MD on an automobile trawl. Currently, the buggies are undergoing combat testing, as announced by Mikhail Degchirev, the governor of the Khabarovsk region. These are not the first buggies sent to the front, similar equipment has previously been delivered and is already in use by the Russian military. Degchirev reported that servicemen have found the off-road vehicle to be excellent in terms of repairability, speed, and maneuverability. The governor added that currently, all produced Arafe buggies are being sent to the front lines, although there are also orders from other security agencies. Degchirev explained that the manufacturer is increasing its production capacity, with the buggies primarily assembled using Russian materials. Additionally, in the engine lineup, alongside power units from friendly countries, a domestic alternative has also been introduced. This project is set to continue and the Khabarovsk company involved in the production of the tactical all-terrain vehicle will become a resident of the ASEZ, Advanced Special Economic Zone, and receive additional support measures. On February 1, 2023, the governor of the region, Mikhail Degchirev, announced on his Telegram channel that the light tactical all-terrain vehicle named Erafe was undergoing comprehensive testing at the training grounds of the Eastern Military District of Khabarovsk. At that time, five prototypes of the Arafay buggy had already been assembled. According to the governor, at the time, plans were underway to establish serial production of the vehicles and equipment, with preparations being made for deployment to the Ukrainian frontline region. The buggy was developed by enthusiasts from Khabarovsk for the Russian army. The name Arafay was chosen through an online vote conducted on a special portal, with three options proposed, Arafay, Amor, and Tiger. The name Erafay pays tribute to the Russian explorer Yerafay Kabarov. In addition to military use, the new buggy, designed for deployment in military zones, is intended to be delivered to rescue teams, forest protection agencies, hunting supervisors, and law enforcement agencies, including the military. The equipment will undoubtedly prove valuable in war conditions. Degchirev stated that production of the Erafay buggy has begun in Kabarovsk with a projected capacity to manufacture up to 20 units per month once full production capacity is reached. Specific tactical and technical characteristics have not yet been disclosed, but it is known that the buggy is designed to accommodate a crew of two people, with a payload capacity of 350 kg and a top speed of 150 km per hour.